I'm Daniel and welcome to the Immuno Project. We here at the Immuno Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to uh, education, information, inspiration, guidance, advice. I want to tell another story about uh, Rabbi Surreal of Rijin. Uh, one time at, uh, he was having a dinner, he said at the table there was many chassidim around him. And Rabbi Surreal said to them, why are so many people dead set against Rabbi Moses ben Maimon, Maimonides? Why, what's, what's, why do people oppose him? Why are the people so, so strongly opposed to what he says? One of the rabbis at the table says, well, because in a certain passage, the Rambam, Moses Maimonides, the Rambam says that Aristotle knew more about the spheres of heaven than Ezekiel. Why shouldn't we be against them? Somebody says something like that. Why not? Rabbi Israel nodded and said, It's just as our master, the Rambam, says. Two people enter the palace of a king. One takes a long time going through each room, lingering over every statute, every objedar, objedar every uh, piece of uh, masterfully crafted furniture, uh, every painting, the sculptures, the, the architecture, just one, because he viewed them with the eyes of an expert and appreciated every stroke of a brush. Another one walks through the same palace beside the other guy. And all he knows is, I am entering the palace of the king. I am walking through the room of the king. I am walking through the doors to the king. Soon I will see the king. Soon I will behold my lord. Soon I will behold the king. He says that's the difference between Aristotle and Ezekiel. Aristotle was a wonderful expert when it came to the workings of God and all the things that are, uh, that are in his palace. But Ezekiel, the Navi, he had the appreciation of where he was and where he was going and who was the owner of all things, the master of all things, the Lord of all things. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Imuna Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.